Now coming to the third one, rRNA, that means ribosomal RNA. Okay, it is synthesized from, it is also synthesized from template DNA, that means single uh, strand of uh, DNA. Okay, 80% of total RNA. So, 15% by tRNA, 5% by mRNA and 80% of total RNA, rRNA. Okay. So, these are the large ribonucleoproteins found in cytoplasm. Okay, where do ribosomes present? They are present in cytoplasm. Okay, they provide site for protein synthesis. Okay, they are in combination with rRNA and proteins. Okay, and they are site of protein synthesis. See here, they have two sites. Okay, and again, two major subunits are there. Okay, rRNA that is 60s subunit and 40s subunits. This is in case of eukaryotes having a 70s ribosome and 80s ribosome. Two types are there eukaryotes and prokaryotes. Okay, and these 80s again divided into two types. Okay, 60s and 40s, right? And they are having two sites. Okay, that means larger subunit 60 subunit is having two sites P site and A site. Okay, A site is a uh, site where amino acid that means tRNA will come okay and attach it to this and transfer its amino acid to the P site okay and P site is a site for protein synthesis okay one after the other amino acids are binding continuously in making of a peptide or a protein okay once the tRNA transfers its amino acid to the P site and that amino acid uh, that tRNA leaves that A site. Again new tRNA will joins to the A site and what is the thing this rRNA is responsible for protein synthesis from amino acid carried by tRNA okay and information provided by mRNA. In ribosomes mRNA tRNA interact to synthesize protein molecule okay ribosomes contain enzymes responsible for connecting the amino acids together in peptide linkage because pe uh, peptide or protein in the sense they are like uh, in peptide linkage okay so for the peptide linkage you require some enzymes okay making of that linkage so those enzymes present in the ribosomes